Cruella de Vil, Cruella de Vil. If that doesn't scare you, no evil thing will. Hey there. This is Matthew Beelmont. Welcome to another trailer reaction video. Let's go to the wonderful but whacked out world of Disney as I take a look at the second trailer to Cruella. And I hate to be a bear poker, but this new film is like Disney's The Joker. Eh, you be the judge of this part. So, here we go. Let's look at this Joker cash and attempt. Let me give you some advice. You can't care about anyone else. Everyone else is an obstacle. You care what an obstacle wants or feels you're dead. If I cared about anyone or thing, I might have died. You have the talent. Whether you have the killer instinct is the big question. <laughs> she thought she owned everyone. It's foolish. Unhinged. Well, you're fired. Why are you speaking? I think you licked me. But there's something about poetic justice that's just so poetic. You won't admit you love me. Hey, 28. <laughs> the devil. Jasper and Horace. <laughs> wow I see where this is going I like the two henchmen Jasper and Horace they're the bad they're, they're, they're helping her so here's what happened a girl gets to work in the fashion industry gets tormented by a jerk and becomes a jerk and fights jerk with jerks and hires two other jerks to take down that jerk that tortured her. Hmm. I see where this is going and yeah, this is like Disney's answer to the Joker in some way, but more feminine. And I laugh because if you remember last trailer reaction video, guaranteed, I don't think I'm not freaking out because when the Joker movie was coming out and being promoted, everybody was complaining that it might lead to crimes, but nothing. So why should I complain that someone is going to make Cruella de Vil inspired crimes? <laughs> That's just silly. I highly doubt there's going to be a Cruella de Vil related crime going on in the newspapers. <laughs> what are the odds of that? That's just silly to laugh at. So. There you have it, and, well, I think it is, uh, good, but, uh, as the saying goes, according to Kara, if the story is good, you're mad at the villain, but if the story is bad, then you're mad at the writer or creator. Well, you be the judge of who you're going to be mad at. So, what do you think? Is it a good film or a disaster? A mistake? I mean, this film could be possible blockbuster buster territory. Yeah, I watch his videos. They're awesome. So, let's see about that. You be the judge. Don't forget to like and subscribe down below. Ring that bell button. And... This is Matthew Beadalon saying, have a nice day.
we're all in this together.